The birth of a child is a joyous and solemn occasion in the life of a family. It is also an occasion for rejoicing in the Christian community. I bid you, therefore, to join with Grady and Heather in giving thanks to Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, the Lord of all life, for the gift of Tristan, their son, and with everyone here for a new... Oh, they don't have a new brother. He doesn't have a brother. That's next. Let us say together. We well, can't say together. Our Father, we'll say the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom, kingdom come, thy will, will be done, done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory. Amen. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Savior, for he has looked, looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day, all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their, their conceit. Yeah, there's just enough light in the he has cast down the mighty from their thrones. He has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of the servant Israel. For he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me to lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He revives my soul and makes me long, takes me along, guides me along right pathways for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, it's good to keep them with us, light in it. The valley of the shadow of death, I shall fear no evil. For you are with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You spread a table before me in the presence of those who trouble me. You have anointed my head with oil, and my cup is running over. Surely your goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. 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 O oh God, you have taught us that through your blessed Son, that whoever receives a little child in the name of Christ, receives Christ himself. We give you thanks for the blessing you have bestowed upon this family, and the giving that child. Confirm their joy by a lively sense of your presence with them, and give them calm strength and patient wisdom as they seek to bring this child to love all that is true and noble, just and pure and lovable and gracious, excellent and admirable, following the example of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Gracious God, we give you a humble and hearty thanks that you have preserved us through the pain and anxiety of the child's birth and that your servant, Heather, now who devotes time to offer you her praises and thanksgiving. Grant most, grant most merciful Father, that by your help she may live, may live faithfully according to your will in this life, and from the partake of the rest of the world in the world to come. Amen. 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 O eternal God, you have promised to be a father to a thousand generations of those who love and fear you. Bless this child, preserve his life, receive him and enable him to receive you, that through the sacrament of baptism he may one day become the child of God through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. That's a stupid prayer. I'll read a child of God. <laughs> <laughs> may the God the Father, who by the baptism adopts us and his children, grant you grace. May God the Son, who sanctified a home at Nazareth, fill you with love. May God the Holy Spirit, and may the church and family keep you in peace. Amen. 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 Amen.